peace don't come. But we fight to keep peace. Amen. Amen. Read on. Shall keep your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. What does the peace of God do? Passeth all understanding. It, it keeps your heart and your minds. Mm -hmm. That's what it does. The peace of God keeps your heart and your minds. You know, because it's the abundance. Whatever's in his heart, this mouth is going to speak. Did you ever, I mean, do you ever know that you're being revealed every time you open your mouth? Amen. At every given time. Every single time. The real true you, the way you are, what you think is revealed to the informed, discerning minds of those who know the spirit of Christ. Amen. Now, a lot of people, since they don't know Christ and stuff, and everybody's in this same old melting pot of hell, a lot of people can't discern what's good or evil. That's true. But those who, who know him, they know you and who you are. You understand what I mean? Hallelujah. Read on, brother. Finally, brethren, mm -hmm. whatsoever things are true. Whatsoever things are what? True. True. Whatsoever things are honest. What are things are honest? honest? Honest. We got true and we have honest. Is that right? Read on. Whatsoever things are just. What? Just? Man, this, these attributes, these characteristics that we're reading about right now, I wonder if they are godly or ungodly. Ungodly. I mean, I, I kind of have a love affair with that kind of talk. Now, this other stuff, malice, guile, hatred, bitterness, hypocrisies, death, and evil speaking, that tells me that somebody else's nature is working. Amen. That's right. Amen. And rather than we're being so concerned about it working through others, we really need to be looking at ourselves. Mm -hmm. But I kind of like this, 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 this talking right here about Whatever things are true, whatever things are honest, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are pure, and what else? And whatsoever things are lovely. Don't this sound pretty good, brothers and sisters? Yeah. Whatsoever things are what? Lovely. lovely. Come on. Whatsoever things are a good report. A evil report or a good report? A good report. A good report. Come on. If there be any virtue. Any virtue. And if there be any praise. Any praise. What is the instruction? Think on these things. Think on what things? These things. These things. And, and what does the majority of the believers think on the majority of time in their life every single day? I'll tell you what it is. The direct opposite. <laughs> the direct opposite. The book just got finished telling us what we need to be thinking on. I didn't say ignore the evil. Because you have to know what the evil is in order to do something good about it. Amen. To prepare yourself. You know what I mean? To defend yourself. You understand what I mean? But we don't really spend a lot of time on these characters, right? These, these, these traits. We should. Amen. But when you got that eye. You ever seen that eye before called suspicion? Well, if you suspicious about somebody else, who's suspicious about you? And if you get a whole congregation where everybody's suspicious, everybody is God in the house or is Satan in the house? Amen. Amen. I just want to know, brother, because I need to ask these questions. Because sometimes when you see all this stuff taking place in the body of Christ, you got to wonder who they serve. And did we all come together to serve Satan or did we all come together to praise and serve God? Amen. But when you start seeing all this other stuff, which is contrary Amen. to the nature of God taking a place amongst the assembly of God, I've got to ask questions. Amen. I mean, I really do. I got to ask questions. Amen. I mean, I'm not here to be deceived. I know I'm in the middle of this thing. I Believe me, I know we're in the middle of this thing. And I don't have the same joy in this middle that I had at the beginning. But it's because the joy that is set before me. Amen. Hey, amen. I, I, I know I see Jesus. There's a finish line up there. Amen. I've gone too far to go back. Amen. And I've come too far to stop. So I might as well just go on and finish. Because the prize is not given to the swift, nor to the strong, but to the one that do what? Endure middle process, this life, this middle process of life, until the end, that one is going to be saved. That's what Christ did. For the joy that was set before him, he went to the cross. Huh? Despising the shame. Hoo-wee. Isn't that boy, I tell you, that's, that's anointing, isn't it? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 
See what the word do if you allow it to transform you. But you you know you gotta allow it though. You you know his word gotta have place in you. If you understand what I mean. Boy, this is good, isn't it? Hallelujah. I hope y'all enjoying this. Lord have mercy. This is good. Amen. Now, of course, you know, I, I've learned over the years that preaching does not do most people good. Now, it's just a fact. I mean, you look at the attrition rate, I don't care where you go. I mean, there are many people come through the doors, but not many people stay. I don't care what you do, where you go. I'm serious, brothers and sisters. Amen. Well, and the reason being is because people have their own ideals. They have their own fears. You know, I talk about this pre-conformed, you know, this ideal the way that we think it ought to be done. And you understand, you have to understand, because we have so much traffic that goes on up here, and we do, if we continue to keep hearing the same amount of traffic, no matter what the Word of God says, you're going to allow that traffic to supersede what the Word says. Amen. And soon your nature is going to follow. That's how we know who you are. We can tell who you are by how you act, how you respond. What you do. That, that lets us know who you are. Amen. We didn't say that, that you're not going to have trouble. But in the midst of the trouble, we're going to see how you act. Amen. How you respond. It lets us know if the nature of Christ is in you. You know, Paul clearly told us there's something in me that is in my flesh. No good thing. So, I mean, I know that there's no good thing. If, he, if Paul didn't have nothing good in his, I know that there ain't nothing good in mine. Amen. So, your flesh don't shock me. I'm looking for the God, his Holy Spirit that lives inside your heart. I'm looking for this walk, this transforming process. I'm looking for that, that person which is new in Christ Jesus that has received the word that says, and be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed, be ye changed by the renewing of your mind. That's the person I'm looking for. I'm looking for that person with me, and I'm looking for that person with you. Amen. Amen. Amen? So when thoughts are communicated to the mind, no amount of preaching, no amount of truth, uh, is going to sway any personal mental agreement that you, you've got. Nothing is going to sway it. Because the transformation process or the being changed is all left up to you. True. Amen? Amen? This is why the word tells us all that we had better learn that we hope what we believe to be in us is the truth. Because if you're not, you not, everybody's going to find out one day. But it's good for you to know right now so you don't have to find out later. You know, God told us that, that we are the people that should have an expected end. Now, a lot of people would deceive themselves about that expected end, but we got an expected end. Amen. All right, follow me? So you continue in goodness. You think on these things, the honest, the true, the just, the things that are pure, the things that are lovely, the things that are good report, if there be any virtue. You think on these things, what do you think that, that your place is going to be in eternity? Amen. But you got a war. You see, when you first started this walk, you may come with all kinds of stuff. And, but slowly but surely, as you get more of God's word, because the spirit and the word of God, he gave you his spirit. Slowly but surely, your mind gets stronger. You're able to 